Let's see what we got. <laughs> what do we got, guys? Pull a booster, booster line. And what that is hissing. Help him with a booster. I don't know what it is. Oh, it looks like a rubbish. Something's hissing. I don't know if there's a propane tank in there or what. <clears throat> Say one, please. Let's see what that is. It smells like. I don't know what it is. Uh, there's, that's what. We, here's what we're hissing. Torch. Who was cooking or using that I did have a little, uh, fire pit, little fire and it was unattended? Yeah, I was sleeping, but the little monster came out and uh, was monkeying around with it. Okay. All right. What do you think he was doing? I need to talk to him and find out exactly what he's doing. Alright. Yeah. Well, you know you left an unattended fire with a miner. You know? Well, yeah, you left it unattended. No, I mean, I was sleeping. No, you left it unattended. No, right? <laughs> okay. You know what I mean? How do you put it out? I pour water on it. Go out there, do it on it. There was, uh, there's some propane torches and stuff like that too. So I don't know if the kid was playing with that stuff or not. So we'll see. We'll see. I'm gonna need to find out exactly what he did and what happened. So. So looks like we might have a juvenile that started this fire. So. Yeah, just Morales, Keo, you guys just hit this really well. I got to get my paperwork, and it's I think this is a juvenile started this. So okay. let me get that done, and we'll get out of here. I don't think he was getting what I was saying. <laughs> so I got to get my photos and, and figure it out. I mean, the kid's three. I mean, you know. Right here. That's what you play with? I'm still venting, too. Oh, I had an auto igniter. Did you push the auto igniter and light it? No? Yeah, it's still, it's still gassing. OK. Yeah, you're OK. You can do your grandma. And you lit the couch on first? And then you just, and then you ran away? Yeah? No, you watched it? What did you do when you lit the fire? I know it's hard, but you're three. I get it. Have you ever seen them light anything before or anything? No? What concerns me is that there was a fire unattended I mean, he said that he fell asleep or went to bed and left it to fire. And then there's stuff for him to play with all over this area, you know? So, I mean, there's... Drady, get over here. You're responsible. 
Well, I don't really need to talk to him yet. I'll get more information from you than I will him. And he's the father? Who's, uh, who's the legal guardian? He's um, at work. He'll be home shortly. OK. And where do, who lives in here? He does, and sometimes uh, his daughter, okay. and sometimes his, his daughter's mother. OK, so then he so he lives he's with you in the house? In OK, house. OK. And what's your address? OK. OK. What really concerns me is that we got lucky. It's not windy out. If it was windy, this would be a whole other issue. This is, there's a lot of rubbish and a lot of stuff here that would have caught fire. This salt sear is like kerosene. It lights up quick. Um, and then look at all the materials and trash and stuff all through this property that's pretty bad. This could have been a pretty bad scene if it would have been windy, you know? It didn't start by this. It started by him lighting it on the couch on fire. You could see right where it started. So, so and there's lighters and stuff everywhere, all over the place. So, you guys, this is pretty good. Feel comfortable? Yeah. I mean, we got. Let's just use it up. Let's just. I want to get make sure this is out. If it's windy tonight. So, so you understand our concern? Yeah. Okay, that's all. And the thing is, though, is he was unsupervised, and he, and this happened with you know with lighters and stuff everywhere. So. Buddy, I don't want to see you ever again, okay? <laughs> huh? No fires. Yeah, no fires. So, it's hard as I mean, he's three, you know? So, all right. Once Chief gets done with his info, we'll get out of here, so. It's important with the juvenile fire starter that we nip this in the butt now. We've had a lot of a lot of problems with kids out here with lighters and stuff, so it's hard though, he's three. Like, I know. You it's know a what I mean? Like, like what do you do? Hey guys, I'm Matt Eisman from Live Rescue. Subscribe to A&E for more videos and catch full episodes on AETV.com.